Yeah, no question. Wisconsin, they have been tremendous on the glass. They're third in the Big Ten in rebounding right now, and they have four of the top 18 rebounders in the conference. And couldn't convert on it, and here's Garantes on the push. Slips the pass to Hilliard. She takes the contact and and one. You see baskets made versus turnovers committed in this first quarter. And Moscow will take the three. And I think that's a smart move just to get them recalibrated for the second quarter. Ooh, 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 Broughton bringing it. Ooh, 17 shooting for the Scarlet Knights. Let's see if Johnson can heat it up. How about that? <laughs> That'll work. She needed to be inserted earlier. Her first shot, first make. Gonna get an overload against this 2-3 zone, but still no high post presence. Even it inside, finding nicely for the easy bucket for Broughton. Give the assist to Liz Martino. Have to work her around to the baseline. Johnson with the kick out here to Broughton, who hangs in hoops. She's got some creativity to her game, doesn't she? Here's Thompson. Got the bucket. And now that's three on Takia Mack. Right next door and all in the neighborhood at the Children's Hospital in Madison. That's kind of a cool story. The camaraderie of the community and that being the heartbeat of the nation. I love that. A couple of quick turnovers here out of the timeout and converting. It's Johnson, the freshman, with an and one chance. And get the ball to the opposite side. It's very simple. It's three passes to break a press. Just relax, calm down. And not relax. That's a bad word to say when you're competing. But just be poised. Take a deep breath. Take your time with your choices that you're making. Broughton again, another bucket. She's got 12 points in the game. Dial it up even more. They knew that that was where they found success. 15 of their points, half of their points were scored off of those turnovers. Two shot attempts, all coming from Hilliard. So you've said time and time again, that's exactly not the place on the court that you want to take it if you're Wisconsin. But again, credit maybe even what the point on that pressure for Rutgers, kind of forcing the ball handler into. You've got to put some zip on it. You've got to ball fake it. Get the ball to the middle. They've done it before, so they need to continue it. Cross court diagonal pass, nicely done as Singleton is the recipient of it. And if you're cutting just to run a play, or if you're cutting just because coach said take a cut, you're not going to get the ball. And if you do, you're not going to be ready to score. It's a carbon copy again. It's back with the putback for Rutgers, but now Rutgers needs to get those stops in a row that they were getting early on in the second half. A wide open look for Moscow. It's a big bucket for Wisconsin. They cut the lead to one. But give Rutgers credit. I mean, this has been their M.O. Giles again, that long reach and wingspan, forcing that turnover. Garantes will take it all the way. Finger roll, finish for two. Only missed one shot. She was four of five in the third quarter. Hmm. That's some good work. And you know she's going to come back in, too. So, you know, she has just been clicking on all cylinders. 15 feet or more, just don't even try it against this Rutgers defense. Right. Taking it all the way. Even a little bit of contact there in the finish for Hillier. Against that zone. Here's Mack. She has to fire a deep three attempt. Just the second three-point make for the Scarlet Knights today. And a dagger to the Wisconsin defense. You know, holding Rutgers all the way to the shot clock expiration on that possession. There's an answer for Estella Moscow. You have to appreciate the apples and oranges of it all. But wow, three fantastically talented players in the Big Ten. Lewis finishes it off, but I thought it might be another turnover. She's gotten herself to the line to produce offense for the Badgers. I mentioned 13 of her 18 points coming into the second half, but maybe more importantly, Christy, she only had two turnovers in the second half. Gave her some confidence, too. I think he was probably saying, hey, when you score, you're, you play at a high level of confidence. You know, the turnovers, that can deflate you quickly, especially when you have seven and a half. She just has so much passion and energy and just great vibes. I would love it. I would have a blast. Well, Mack, one of the four players for Rutgers in double figures. She had 11, brought with 18. And the career high six steals today. Johnson with the 17. That's a new career high for the freshman. And Garantes with 16. And so Rutgers picking up a win.